Once upon a time, long, long ago. Well, more like 20 years ago. Belle married her beast in front of 6,000 of their closest personal friends. <laughs> Big cake. Yeah, so instead of a honeymoon, Beast united all of the kingdoms and got himself elected King of the United States of Oridon. He rounded up all the villains and sidekicks, basically all the really interesting people, and he booted them off to the Isle of the Lost with a magical barrier to keep them there. This is my hood. No magic, no Wi-Fi, no way out. Or so I thought. Hang on, you're about to meet us. But first, this happened. Head. How is it possible that you're gonna be crowned king next month? You're just a baby. He's turning 16, dear. Hey, Pops. 16? It's far too young to be crowned king. I didn't make a good decision until I was at least 42. Uh, uh, you decided to marry me at 28. I was either you or a teapot. <laughs> Kidding. Mom, Dad. Ah. Mm mm. I've chosen my first official proclamation. I've decided that the children on the Isle of the Lost be given a chance to live here in Oridon. <laughs> Every time I look out to the island, I feel like they've been abandoned. The children of our sworn enemies living among us. Well, we started out with a few at first. Only the ones who need our help the most. I've already chosen them. Have you? I gave you a second chance. Who were their parents? Corella Deville, Jafar, Evil Queen, and Maleficent. Oh, Maleficent! She is the worst villain in the land! Dad, just hear me out here. I won't oh. hear of it. They are guilty of unspeakable crimes. Dad, their children are innocent. Don't you think they deserve a shot at a normal life? Dad. I suppose the children are innocent. Well done. Ha <laughs> ha 